रिकम्बिनेंट डीएनए टेक्नोलॉजी रिकम्बिनेंट डीएनए टेक्नोलॉजी एंड दिस रिकम्बिनेंट डीएनए मीन्स द डीएनए ऑफ टू ऑर्गेनिज्म इज गोइंग टू बी मिक्सड बाई यूजिंग बायोटेक्नोलॉजी मेथडोलॉजी सो द बेस्ट एग्जाम्पल इज हेपेटाइटिस बी बी वैक्सीन हेपेटाइटिस बी वैक्सीन विच वॉज क्रिएटेड विच वॉज क्रिएटेड by using recombinant dna technology and they are termed as second generation vaccine how they were created it will be dealt in the in, in, uh, science and technology part okay recombinant dna vaccine so in this case you have the dna of bacteria and that will have fragment of dna which is of virus so there is viral dna which is inserted in bacterial dna and basically this virus is having a structure that have a capsid which is made up of protein na uska virus ke paas bhi apna sharir hota hai bhai it is made up of protein which is called as capsid na and inside the capsid the genetic material is there that may be rna that may be dna this is the virus okay and this capsid is made up of protein aur koi bhi protein hamare sharir mein tabhi banta hai ya kisi bhi organism mein once the organism is containing gene for that very protein that means a gene is responsible for making the protein whatever the color of our eyes color of our skin height the metabolism all being controlled by our genome isn't it so gene is responsible for making protein and those protein are responsible for deciding traits similarly in virus also this some gene is responsible for making this protein ab ye wala protein ka kholi pehen ke koi virus aayega to pehchan mein aayega ki nahi because is gene ko yahan is dna se ligate kar diya gaya this gene was viral dna was ligated into bacterial dna now this protein is also produced inside the cell okay and from this cell the protein is separated purified and now the, this become recombinant dna vaccine recombinant dna vaccine that means in recombinant dna vaccine we are producing mass base production of this protein na you understand by using biotechnology we will discuss later in detail so this protein is now going to be the re recombinant dna vaccine once it is administered in the body the body will make antibody against those protein and the antibody will always be ready for for entertaining this virus and if the hepatitis b virus is entering in the body immediately it is going to be vanished so this is recombinant dna protein second generation vaccine and the third generation vaccine is called as dna vaccine dna vaccine and this dna vaccine is simple the fragment of dna this is the fragment of dna fragment of dna of pathogen directly administered in form of vaccine in form of vaccine okay fragment of dna directly of pathogen directly administered in form of vaccine they are called as dna vaccine or third generation vaccine okay and another is conjugate vaccine conjugate vaccine so the feeble antigen jiske liye jaise maan lijiye hame typhoid conjugate vaccine banani hai na typhoid conjugate vaccine to so, typhoid ko cause karne wala jo bacteria uska naam hai salmonella typhi isko proper weightage nahi milta tha 
वैक्सीन बनाया अंदर गया कुछ ही सालों के बाद फिर से टाइफाइड हो जाता था बिकॉज द एंटीबॉडीज विच इज क्रिएटेड इज नॉट गोइंग टू हैव स्ट्रॉन्ग एंटीबॉडीज एंड इन अदर केसेज ऑल्सो वी नीड टू हैव बूस्टर डोज ना यू ऑल हैव दिस आइडिया आफ्टर सम टाइम द इम्यूनिटी इज गोइंग टू डिक्लाइन सो वी रिक्वायर बूस्टर डोज वाई टू हैव बूस्टर डोज टू स्ट्रेंथन द इम्यूनिटी ओके सो द इम्यूनिटी इज डिक्लाइनिंग विथ टाइम for other also but there are some uh, disease whose immunity is declined very rapidly unke liye conjugate vaccine banayi gayi to conjugate vaccine is some stronger antigen stronger antigen along with antigen what is the antigen dono antigen mein antar kya hai ye stronger antigen ye bada bhai hai jiski pehchan hai college mein aur ye antigen kaun hai नया एडमिशन एडमिशन हुआ है जिसके खिलाफ वी हैव टू क्रिएट इम्यूनिटी सो दिस दिस वीकर एंटीजन दिस इज वीकर एंटीजन और किसका वैक्सीन आप बनाना चाहते हो फॉर दिस वीकर एंटीजन कैसा वैक्सीन फॉर लॉन्ग गिविंग लॉन्गर इम्यूनिटी दैट कैन गिव लॉन्गर इम्यूनिटी यू अंडरस्टैंड सो गिविंग लॉन्गर इम्यूनिटी दिस एंटीजन एलॉन्ग विथ स्ट्रॉगर एंटीजन यू हैव क्रिएटेड अ वैक्सीन that will be called as conjugate vaccine that will be called as conjugate vaccine so what will be the outcome so once this stronger antigen along with weaker antigen administered as vaccine in the body antibodies are formed for this weaker antigen as well as a stronger antigen simultaneously so in case of uh, what you can say further entry and these are the antibodies which is fit to kill both the antigen na any of the antigen and both the antigen so whenever there will be entry of the pathogen the immunity is going to be stronger and it will kill the antigen which is associated with this ye chote wale ki halat kharab ho jayegi bade bhai ko bhi kehna chahiye ki chote tujhe padhai karni chahiye ladai nahi conjugate vaccine stronger antigen along with weaker antigen creating stronger immunity for both the antigen and this immunity is long lasting that is produced by conjugate vaccine see uh, it will be uh, discussed in uh, what you can say biotechnology i hope but uh, let me explain suppose that this is hepatitis b virus तो इससे पूछोगे आप तो ये बताएगा कि देखो भाई मेरे चारों तरफ प्रोटीन का स्ट्रक्चर है आई एम अ बॉडी बिल्डर एंड माय बॉडी इज मेड अप ऑफ प्रोटीन ना दिस इज प्रोटीन एंड दिस प्रोटीन इज कॉल्ड एज सरफेस प्रोटीन दिस प्रोटीन इज कॉल्ड एज सरफेस प्रोटीन फिर इससे कहोगे अच्छा ये सरफेस प्रोटीन आपको बना के किसने दिया कहा यार क्या बात करते हो मेरे पास जीन है जिससे हमने ये सरफेस प्रोटीन बनाया सो आई हैव अ जीन दैट हैव क्रिएटेड दिस सरफेस प्रोटीन मैं कहा अच्छी बात है आई एम अ बायोटेक्नोलॉजिस्ट यू हैव यू जस्ट आइसोलेटेड दिस जीन दिस जीन इज सरफेस प्रोटीन जीन एंड यू सेंड इट टू द वेक्टर and inserted into e coli genome this is e coli which is a bacteria na abhi chuki mujhe ye sari cheeze batana what is dna what is gene that's why i'm not going in the detail but indeed i hope this much you know so bata de raha hu so now this e coli is having its own genome and along with this e coli isko dusre color se banane do ye raha aapka e coli and in this e coli you have inserted what this gene this uh, surface protein gene is ko insert kar diya gaya and indeed it requires genetic engineering tools techniques aise board pe likhne se nahi ho jata so now this e coli will produce some protein protein banayenge apne jeevan ke liye along with those protein they also protein they also make those protein which is सरफेस प्रोटीन ये वाला प्रोटीन बनेगा कि नहीं सो इन द एक्सट्रैक्ट ऑफ ई कोलाई 
extract of E. coli, cell extract of E. coli, you are going to have this surface protein or not? Answer is yes. So, this surface protein is now isolated, purified. Now, this surface protein ko aapne kya kiya? Vaccine ke roop mein use kar liya. You use this surface protein as vaccine. So, now this protein will enter inside aur aisa protein lekar ke koi bhi aayega, usko wo antibody maaregi ki nahi? Answer is yes. And you are using this recombinant DNA. What is recombinant DNA? DNA of two organism or more than one organism is recombinant DNA. And this is recombinant DNA vaccine. 